I'm Tricia, a California organic gardener. I'm behind the Peaceful Valley Farm and Garden Supply Warehouse where we have our bare root container forest. These trees are just waiting to be shipped out and Keith is going to demonstrate that process. The trees on the order are pulled from these labeled bins. The bins are filled with wet sawdust which keeps the roots moist. This healing in process is important. In order to fit this tall two-year-old tree in the box, Keith is going to have to do some pruning. We're going to prune both the roots and the branches. The roots will regrow rapidly after planting. There's no need to be concerned about this because as you'll see in my pruning video, we're going to actually recommend that you prune it to about 30 inches. We work closely with our tree grower to make sure that the amount of pruning that we do won't stunt the growth or kill the tree. And we have a replacement guarantee. We guarantee that your tree will leaf out. The trees are placed into a bag with moist sawdust to protect the roots during transit. Now the trees are going to be placed in this sturdy tree box. And by the end of the day, they'll be off and on their way to your door. When the trees arrive, open the box immediately. Then you also want to open the plastic bag. Don't leave the trees in the bag any longer than necessary. Inspect your trees carefully upon arrival. You want to check the grafts and make sure there's no severed grafts or any loose unions. If you notice any damage, be sure and call our customer service department right away. So what if you can't plant your trees as soon as you receive them? That's okay, you can heal them in and plant them when the time is right. To heal your trees in, choose a shady location and dig a trench about a foot deep. If your ground is frozen, you can heal in either in the cellar or in the garage. Place the trees in the trench, bundled as closely together as possible, leaning against the slope. Cover the roots with loose soil, compost, or wood shavings. Avoid using rice hulls, cedar, or redwood shavings. And it's important not to let your tree's roots dry out or freeze. You want to keep the roots moist, but not soaking wet. The point of healing in is to keep the roots moist, protect the tree from freezing, and keep it cool enough that it doesn't break dormancy. If your ground is frozen or if you're under snow, you can create the same environment in a wheelbarrow or some other type of container and store it in your basement or your garage. If you see the buds swell and then the tree starts to flower, it has broken dormancy and it needs to be planted immediately. If you can plant your trees right away and there's no need for healing in, be sure and check out our tree planting video and grow organic for life.